So I got the privilege of getting to see this film at Sundance, and I got to be there on the carpet mm. with the robot. And I have to say, it seemed so real just from being there. For you guys, for, for me, watching the film, I got Rose Byrne to take me through the story. Mm. But for you, you had a man in a suit. What was it like kind of making that real for both of you? Well, you had more scenes with him, so yeah. I'll let you elaborate um, on that. If you think it was life like on just there, when Luke actually wasn't inside it, he's, first of all, he's such an incredible actor, so him providing a performance inside the suit was terrifying. Um, but he was, yeah, phenomenal. Um, and again, it, it made it so much easier for us to be able to just connect to this essentially piece of metal. Um, yeah, no, it was, it was really great. And for you, Hillary? Well, you know, first of all, when I, when I read the script, I was thinking of Mother's position and this idea of how, why she was created to um, recreate the human species as perfect. Mm. But what is that? You yeah. know, what is that? What does that mean? What is perfect? How and from whose it? eyes? Yeah, mm. how did you find that? And so the idea of this, First of all, I didn't know much about AI and that people are making AI. I mean, it's 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 not in our far future. So the idea of that and what that means and kind of just where we are as a as a as a world, mm -hmm. you know, where are we right now with what, what are we doing to each other and the idea of just morals and ethics and all of this. So uh, it's very thought provoking, um, and I felt like the character was, you know, um, from her point of view. Um, just trying to do her job at hand. It's, yeah. it's you know, I mean, obviously, the, people are going to have so many thoughts about it, and that's what's exciting. Uh, I feel um, like you guys, you, t you talked a lot about, like, the human connection in the movie, because daughter, that's all she knew was mother, so mm -hmm. it's insane that mm -hmm. she still, she craved that nurturing. Mm -hmm. Can you talk about that a little bit? Yeah, I mean, I, if, again, it's so indented in our DNA as, as human beings, the whole, I mean, we're flock animals, you know? We, we thrive of being together and being with each other and being able to trust each other. And uh, I, I think daughter has always had this yearning for human connection, uh, even though she had everything she could have gotten from her mother, uh, who raised her and taught her everything she knows. Now you you talked a little about striving for perfect, and I feel like mother is the kind of modern mommy dearest. You know, she she's very stern. She wants you to do right. Do you kind of see that in her? That I feel like that's as strong of character as the robot turned out to be. Um, like a mommy dearest in mm -hmm. the her. Well, yeah. yeah. I mean, she is. I mean, well, as the movie goes and you learn some of the things that she's done, it feels like that very much so. Um, and the idea though of her. Um, that, like how much you love her because mm. you're a human being, but it seems like she loves you. And uh, yeah, it's very, it is like that a little bit. And I never yeah. even thought about that. And how I experience her um, is clearly very different than you experience her because what, I, what I've seen is, um, you know, a very different side of that. So it's, it's also the, the multifaceted sides of not only a human being, but of AI. Yeah. <laughs> I have to say, congratulations on a great